What's up guys, it's Kayla from KB Fitness. This is your at-home workout for today. So you guys will be working for three minutes, resting for one minute, all right? And for the three minutes, you guys will be rotating every minute um, to a different movement with a minute of rest for that fourth um, minute, all right? You guys will do this for five rounds. All right, so our first movement will be thrusters. Second movement will be one leg lift crunches. And then your third movement will be slow RDL. So that'll be three seconds down, three seconds up. And I'll show you guys that during the demo here in just a second. And then your fourth minute will be a minute of rest. And again, you guys will cycle through that for five rounds. So for our first movement today, we have thrusters and I'll be using a torpedo today. You guys can use a backpack um, or anything that you guys have at home or one dumbbell if you guys have that at home or even a ball if you have one at home. All right, so for the thrusters, we're gonna be up in that front rack position, all right? Feet are gonna be right underneath the hips, toes pointed out slightly, and then we're just gonna squat all the way, pop those hips and drive that object up overhead. Make sure you guys lock the elbows, shrug the shoulders. All right, so let's show you guys that one more time. For our second movement, our second minute of this workout, you guys will be doing one leg lift crunches. All right, so we're gonna be on the ground for this one, all right? Dumbbell's gonna be over your head, all right? And then we're gonna pretend like we're doing a um, glute bridge, all right? So as we bring that object up, we're gonna think of crunching, lifting the hips, bringing the knee to that object, and then bringing the hips back down as we bring that object back over our head, all right? And then we'll just alternate legs for that one. Again, down as we bring the dumbbell back down, all right? So make sure those shoulders are coming off the ground when you go into that crunch, all right? And then our third minute of work will be slow RDLs. Again, that will be three seconds down, three seconds up, all right? So with your object, we're just gonna think of hinging those hips back, slight bend in the knees, all right? So it should be one 1,000, two 1,000, three 1,000, and then the same thing on the way back up. One, 1,000, two, 1,000, three, 1,000. So we're not racing to the bottom, all right? So it's not one, two, three, one, two, three. Make sure you guys are counting in those 1,000s to really activate those hamstrings in the back, all right? Once you guys finish that, you guys will have a minute of rest, and then we'll go through that for five times. If you guys um, want to think of a strategy for this one so you guys aren't gassed going into the third, fourth, and fifth round, you guys can either do 40 seconds of work 20 seconds of rest, so you guys have a little bit of transition time in there, or you guys can do 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, all right? So whatever works for you, that's fine, um, but that's a good strategy to make sure that you guys aren't gassed going into those last couple rounds, and will actually be able to keep up with what you were doing in the first and second round, okay?